All right, I'm gonna do a little experiment. We've got this little painting here, um, six by six, I think. I've got a varnish of sorts on top of it. It's basically the isolation varnish. Um, this is the one I have on there right now. Uh, gloss medium, simply acrylic. But what I'm going to do is apply this Mod Podge to it. I've put this on a couple of other of my paintings. Uh, I've seen it on YouTube a few times and it, I like the way it was looking, but I want to see if it does any different effect on top of this isolation or if it stays the same. Uh, so I'm going to apply that and see what happens. Alright, here we go. This doesn't take long to dry, so I shouldn't have to wait too long. And just stop my canvas from going crazy here. Uh, let's see. Hey, well, I'm gonna apply this without the video, just showing. I'm just doing strokes. It uh, doesn't have to be uniform as far as up and down kind of go all over with this as long as you don't overwork it um, come back when I'm done you can see how it looks after a layer all right so this is how it looks after applied the first coat uh, we're gonna let that dry I'll we'll come back and see um, before and after with one coat of Mod Podge I've also read on the label that this is a water base so maybe try might try one later diluting a little bit with water but may not need to i mean because you can go layer after layer and it seems to spread pretty well it seems to flow pretty good so uh, let's check back when it's dry all right so this is pretty much completely dried already it's only been about it's only been like five minutes maybe not even uh man it looks I like it. Uh, it's not like a big difference as far as the sheen, but there is a difference. It does have more of a shine on there. Uh, this is the gloss. Um, there are different ones, and this is only one coat, actually. Um, what I like the best about it is the uh, other stuff I had under there was a lot more tacky and sticky. And this seems to be drying um, really good where it's not as tacky. So, um, I've applied this to a few other paintings before I did this little experiment, but I forgot to take it before and after. So, um, if you're in the market for something that's inexpensive to cover up your paintings, uh, man, I recommend this. Um, my verdict is this is some good stuff. This was only about six bucks for eight ounces. Uh, this was at uh, Walmart. Hey, uh, Mod Podge, throw your boy some love. All right, y'all take care.